This Planet for the week ending July 6, 2018. Forests covering an area roughly the size of the Philippines were cut down or burned to make way for farms in 2017. From Africa to Indonesia to the Amazon, tropical forests were felled at a rate equivalent to 40 soccer fields per minute. This is bad news in two ways. Trees soak up the greenhouse gas CO2 as they grow, but release it back into the atmosphere when they burn or decay. And many of the endangered wild species that inhabit the earth, from tiny frogs to top predators, rely on forests to survive. One group with a novel solution to these problems is Half Earth. Spearheaded by the famous biologist and author E.O. Wilson, the group of 47 scientists is proposing that humankind set aside half the planet in nature reserves to protect Earth's biodiversity. They want to set aside half the land and half the water as sanctuaries for all species. We caught up with Typhoon Paparone as it drenched parts of South Korea and Japan, briefly attaining Category 1 force near Okinawa. Veterinarians in Australia believe they know why eastern grey kangaroos have been staggering as if they were drunk and then dying. The animals could be suffering from the effects of eating new shoots of phalaris grasses, also known as canary grass. The imported strain has been popular with some Australian farmers, even though it can cause similar symptoms in livestock, especially sheep. Further research is underway to determine for sure if the grass is the cause of the rude deaths. For This Planet, I'm Steve Newman.